code signal, CADE, databases, expressions, verifications. Hello everyone, my name is Joshua and I'll be solving expressions, verifications. Let's begin. So you're a math teacher at an elementary school and you just taught your kids about plus minus times divide. And now you want to give the students homework and you want to check if they did it correctly. Now you have given they have this information given ID, A, B, operations like these, and C, which is the, expect, which is the answer that they input it. Oh, I think you're a student, actually. <laughs> Wait, hold for a second. Oh, I see. Okay, I, I see what you mean. Okay, so they want me to design an algorithm that will quickly check if they got the answers correct or not, and will just return the answers that are correct. So, for example, like we have ID, A, B, C. Someone input all this certain information. And it will only output those that you've done correctly. Here it's done correctly because Chu 3 with the plus sign is 5. 4, 7 times is 28. You know what's strange? I, you know, a side tangent story. I think, is it in Germany or in Poland? They have this weird way of doing your operations where it's they give the values and do a post operation right here. And then show that you want to do this output. Sorry, I got distracted. Let's begin. Um, <laughs> So here, we want to select basically still all the columns. So star represent we want all of them from. Oh wow, why did I click there? From the table of expressions. Now for the filter, where? So how are we going to do this? Okay, there are different scenarios we want to consider. I could do a bunch of crazy if else statements, but that could take forever. So we could use something that is similar to a switch statement if you are a programmer before. If you're not familiar with it, um, don't worry. I'll tell you, introduce you to something called a case. The case is almost, it's, it's basically like a bunch of if-else statements, except much more quicker to write. It's basically, uh, here, it's better if I actually put the answer, so, I mean, yeah, write the answer so you have an understanding of how this works. So to use a case, you start with a case, put an end, and you put a, put a bunch of possible scenarios that you're looking for, and when you have those scenarios, when those conditions are are found, then you execute the expressions that you want to do. So, for example, with case here, um, one condition I want to consider is when the operation is equal to. Let's start with a plus sign. Yep. Then I want to execute the condition when a plus b. That's what I want to return. So that's an example right there. Now another condition I want to consider when operation equals minus, then A minus B. So you see the pattern here, operation equals then A times B. I can also do this other one for this one operation for divide, but to show how to show better how cases work, we'll just say that you have all these conditions except any other operation. Then we can use an else statement. The default ex execution will be a divided by b. Now, when that's done, this case statement returns whatever rows or whatever the rows will go undergo this certain operation. At the end, though, we want to compare where whether these cases after we go through those operations, we want to compare it if it's equal to c because we want to check if it's the correct answer. All right. Now, after that. We want to order it by ID. So order by ID. All right. Now end it with a semicolon. Now let's see. If we can run this operation to see if this works. Great. Now hit submit. Awesome. I'm glad it passed. All right, guys. I hope you like this content. Please like and subscribe. And if you do, as soon as you hit the like and subscribe. Behind you, I'm standing right behind you already, ready to give you a freaking high five in person. And uh, I'm and basically, if you like and subscribe, you're making the world a better place because my content will provide this free education to everyone around um, who doesn't know how to solve this question. And you know, you're promoting my content will give them easier access to solve questions like these. So, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that was a joke or not, and it's some huge hint of truth to that. Have a good day, guys. Take care.